There we go guys, all your component parts of a quick shift actuator. Tank, clutch housing, clutch seals, main ram, main ram seals, seal shaft seals, seal shaft, end caps, clutch end cap, pentameter, pentameter, end cap, circlips, these are the seals for your solenoids, obviously hydraulic pipe, sensor, there's three of those, this is all reverse, reverse mechanism, reverse end cap, reverse seals, obviously this is your uh, loom, all tested, main body all cleaned out and tested, no problem, pump, this is the pump motor, this is the pump, these C's very often, jam the pump, blow the fuse, this is your uh, back end of your actuator. This is your accumulator, just been tested to 50 bar. This one's actually um, pumps up like new. And this is your switch. Now this switch here can cause you all sorts of problems. Although it will work, sometimes it won't switch the pump on at the correct uh, time. It will let it drop below 40 bar and then switch it on. And then you'll find yourself sometimes either popping yourself into neutral or it will um, basically just um, uh, not let you go up the next gear this is your filter filter cap goes in the end here um, just down there not by this sticky out bit there's another bit down there goes goes in there uh, this has all been tested and cleaned uh, the solenoids I've stripped them cleaned them the seals are in good condition they're not swollen uh, these seals are in good condition uh, I've took them off and checked them they're excellent and uh, it's all ready to go back together there you go that robot when it came in someone had filled it up with the wrong fluid uh, tqf which is a no-no speedmatic sales speed oil only uh, the tqf had uh, pushed past the uh, uh, reverse seals and filled up this end with fluid and it had started to hydraulic the back end of the unit so it wouldn't change gear uh, now it's all cleaned out ready to go and uh, it should be a perfect pump all working correctly the actuator itself was in excellent condition tested this pump this pump runs spot on and you get plenty of pressure out of the actual uh, pump itself it's in excellent condition there you go guys there's all your component parts minus two sensors because I've not got them out of the packet yet because I'm putting new ones on uh, happy days